Hi, Pam Adair with some thoughts for today. So this morning I'm rereading T. Harv Eckhart's book, The Secrets of a Millionaire Mind. Now I read this probably about five years ago, but you know I'm in a completely different place than I was then and so of course it's like a completely different book. So what I was reading this morning that struck me and I wanted to share with you was he talked about the difference between the poor, the middle class, and the rich. Now the poor are living in survival, so their whole life is about defense. You know, they're just trying to stay, you know, stay in survival and make sure you get your rent paid and your food covered and those kinds of things. And I know there's been periods in my life where that's what I felt like I was doing. I was just trying to survive, trying to figure out how to get enough money in to cover what I needed to cover. Now the middle class, it's all about being comfortable. And um, and I've lived a lot of my life there where it's just about having enough so that you're not stressed out, so you have enough to cover things, but it doesn't give you the freedom to make choices that you might really want to make. For example, for me, recently I got stuck in the LA air, um, airport overnight and there was actually a choice I could have made to buy another airline ticket because I went out and checked and I could have spent some money and flown back that night but I just felt like I couldn't justify spending that money and so I stayed overnight in the airport. That was a moment of clarity for me because I thought I am so done with having money be the deciding factor for me. And that's the difference between the middle class and the rich. The, with the rich, the money's not making the decision. And that's not to say we don't look at, you know, at money and make, make wise choices, but it's not the deciding factor. It doesn't decide, for example, something many of us have experienced what we're going to order off a menu, you know, looking at the right hand side of the menu instead of what you really want. And I have decided, I've cut, drawn a line in the sand, I'm ready to live my life in freedom. And for me, that means living a rich lifestyle where money isn't going to be the deciding factor. Anyway, I want to share that thought with you.